Hey there, baseball fans. It's Ben, and I'm here today with a brand new factory sealed 1993 Series 2 Top Stadium Club baseball card set here. I'm really looking forward to uh, breaking into this. I don't know that I've ever actually opened a pack of 1993 Stadium Club. It might not be true, but I think that's true. I think, um, you know, as, as a collecting kid, 93 is when I kind of like started to wean off of the whole thing. Oh, it was double wrapped. Because that was the, I guess, just the, for the store. And then this is the actual, you can see it got the um, top marks on there. So this is the actual wax, or I guess cellophane wrapping. And I just have to use some scissors in here. There we go. But I don't think I've ever actually opened a pack of these definitely have not opened a box so this is pretty exciting for me um you know like i said by 1993 i started to kind of get away from card collecting as a kid so I'm not as familiar with uh these cards but i'm super stoked about it, it includes action photos of the florida marlins and colorado rockies free master photo enclosed collect special first day production cards and win stadium club master photos so that all sounds very exciting. There's, there we go. Let's take a handful of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is when Top said, uh, let's just start giving you only 24 packs per box instead of 36. So let's just start off with these six and see where this takes us. I'm not even sure what I'm exactly what I'm looking for in here. I would love to get Ryan Sandberg, Nolan Ryan. Um, I don't, I don't know if Nolan, yeah, I guess Nolan and I would probably still be in here. Um, Mark Grace, Sean Dunstan, because I don't think I have these in my current collection. So let's see what we get. So you can see, uh, definitely these still full color pictures there, still showing the rookie cards, but in a different orientation. And these are those super UV glossy ones that all stick together in the old, with the, uh, with these old cards. So oh, look at that first pack, Ryan Sandberg, member's choice. Oh, I'm really excited to get this one. Look at that. Look at Rhino there. Yeah, super excited. That one be added in my collection. And I do not have that one for sure. So that makes me super happy. I don't know if we can get much better than that. Info card. First production of any item is in a collectible category is considered special. First day stamp covers, first minted coins, now Stadium Club gives collectors the opportunity to own first day production cards from each Stadium Club series. Imprint the card with a special foil containing first day production. Randomly inserted, if you would in 2000, each Stadium Club card would be first day production. All right, great. So we'll keep an eye out for those first day production cards. I'm not sure if they're worth anything, but worth looking out for. So that's fun. Oh, there's Randy Johnson. Oh, I like that. That's a cool picture. Him with the broken bat. Put that one aside. George Bell. Very cool. All right. Pack number two. I do really dislike the cellophane wrapping though. It's really tough to get into and Stadium Club was like that for years. Uh, Alright, there's a Marlins card in action. I remember when the Rockies and the Marlins first came out, it really was a pretty big deal. Everybody was very excited to uh, get their hands on those cards. What's this? Club membership in the Stadium Club. Oh, there's a Mike Piazza. I think that is a maybe a rookie card too, so that's probably a pretty decent card. Mike Piazza, we'll put him aside. Chuck McElroy. So, so far, I think we're off to a pretty darn good start here. Most of the cards I open up, I'm very, very familiar with the sets and very familiar with all the cards in there. I've seen them a million times. So it's kind of exciting to do one uh, that I haven't really spent much time with and that it feels like brand new when I'm 
going through them and seeing all these cards. Yvonne Rodriguez, member's choice. Very nice. Put that aside. Edgar Martinez. That's a good one. Eric Karras. For a while there, he was a pretty important uh, player to collect, but he kind of fell off. Whatever happened to Steve Bouchelle, I wonder. Maybe we'll put him aside and take a look at whatever happened to Steve Bouchelle. Chuck Knobloch. We know what happened to him. Gonzalez, Brian Hunter, Master Photo, there you go, you're a Master Photo winner. This card entitles you to three Stadium Club Master Photos from the Stadium Club Baseball Series 2. There you go, I won. I have won Mark McGuire, George Brett, and Ruben Sierra. All right, let's see when this ends. Maybe I can still claim them. Nope, cards must be redeemed by 131.94. So instead, we'll just put that aside and put that in our Mark McGuire pile. And, and there you have it. Ryan Klesko. Did Ryan Klesko ever turn into anything? I kind of feel like he was going to be, but then maybe he didn't turn out the way everybody thought he would. Rusty Meacham. Actually, I want to figure out what happened to Rusty Meacham. Sorry, Steve Michelle, we'll save it for another time. Rusty Meacham. I'm going with that one. Ruben Sierra, ooh, on the A's. Late career for him. William Pettyfeather. Never heard of him. And Glen Allen Hill. Marquise Grissom, Grissom, Numbers Choice. Mickey Morandini. Ruben Amaro. And Eric Davis on the Dodgers. All right, one more pack to go. Still super happy about that Ryan Sandberg. That'll be a nice one to add to my, my book. There's Jack Morris. Oh, Barry Larkin. Good action shot of him. All twist, pretzel twisted up. Carlos Delgado. Lee Smith late in his career. Oh, look at that. Pedro Martinez. I think that's a rookie card, too. Very nice. Excellent. Cal Eldred played for the University of Iowa. Rico Baronia. I remember him from the uh, his Phillies days when I was a, living in the Philadelphia area and a Phillies fan. So let's take a look at what happened to old Rusty Meacham here. At this point, he looks like he's on the Royals there. After having been with the Tigers to start. Rusty Meacham... Former baseball player, eight seasons between 91 and 2001. 23 and 17, 
443 ERA, 198 strikeouts, so not stellar stats. Played for the Tigers, Royals, Mariners, Astros, and Devil Rays. After spending three entire seasons with in AAA, he resurfaced with the Houston, Houston Astros in 2000. After his major league career ended, he pitched in independent leagues. Kept trying to hold on and trying to make it back, I guess. Became the first base coach for one of those teams. Began pitching coach for Vermont Lake Monsters. He turned to pitching one game for the GBL's Tijuana Cimarrones in 2010. Rusty collaborated on a baseball instruction book and DVD, which became available in June 2011. So there you go. Rusty Meacham. Baseball lifer, holding on to the dream even when it kind of had his shot and it passed him by. So, Rusty, hope you're out there having a good time. Much respect for making the bigs and making a career out of it. The rest of you, I'll see you later. Bye.